good. Don't forget that weather app though, 24 seven weather at your fingertips, <coughs> available for Android and iPhone devices. See, thank you. If you don't have a ticket to the big game sold out Saturday, you know, the Jags home opener at Lad People Stadium, you are out of luck. Or are you? Well, finding a ticket may be a tough sell, but don't worry. Local 15 Stephen Quinn is live from campus with how you can stay connected during tomorrow's game. Stephen, we need to know this. Yeah, you do, Darwin, because obviously it's not easy uh, to get a ticket right now with it being officially sold out. And one other thing of note, uh, obviously anticip anticipation for this game has been building. If you've driven around long enough, you've seen one of the billboards that have been around promoting this matchup against Mississippi State. Almost 40,000 people are expected to be there at the game tomorrow, and the stadium is expected to be buzzing. And the Jags Media Relations Department, well, they're hoping that Facebook and Twitter are doing the same. Now, if you are in the stands, make sure to use the hashtag JagNation. And we spoke with the Athletics Department about how you can stay connected no matter where your seat is throughout the course of the game if you're not there and you don't have access to listen to the radio broadcasts uh, through iHeartRadio, uh, there will be live stats available at usajaguars.com and then we also live tweet from the press box and that's at USA Jaguar Sports. Now, Darwin and Kelly, we've posted a link under the Find It section of our website with every way that you'll be able to watch or be involved with tomorrow's game. Stay tuned to Local 15 News at 6 o'clock. We're going to be speaking to Dr. Joel Erdman. He's the athletic director here. And we're going to be speaking to a guy that you guys may remember, Local 15 Today alum Pat Greenwood. He's going to be here as well talking to X's and O's. That's all coming up later in the show. Guys, back to you. Steven, thank you so much. Yes, social media is a big deal, especially to fans who can't make it there mm -hmm. and they want to stay connected. That is a big deal. Because you, you can get the score or who touched out and got a touchdown really